Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 20th. What I see so far for today is, you know, it's about thinking. It's like thinking, is it worth it? Is it worth it? What sh is it worth it? Is it worth it to invest in this? Is it worth it to keep going this path? thinking about leaving it all behind and starting over someplace else it's like I just want to go I just want to leave this all behind I just want freedom 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 I don't I don't want to do this anymore I feel like that's the energy that's the energy that is going on because I first I see the seven of pentacles then I see the fool okay so the seven of pentacles is about investment it's about is it worth it is it worth it or should I just take this risk and and leap, leap off this cliff into this unknown territory. It's like there's a, and it's, it's an exciting moment. It's, it is a moment of excitement. I think we have somebody here that is really ready. It's like I am ready to fly, um, and just leave that. There's, there's nothing left. There's nothing left here. I just, I just want to go. I just want to go. So it's like, and I feel like somebody is leaving with a smile on their face because I see a smile. It's like I see a smile. Um, this is exciting. Somebody is full of excitement. Uh, exciting, excited for this new chapter. Excited for this new adventure. So it's it's an exciting time. It really is. I see, I see a lot of excitement in somebody's face. It's like, this makes me so happy that I get to do this, that I'm, I'm going to do this. I, and this person has a lot of confidence. I see somebody with a lot of confidence that is uh, about to make a big, bold move. Okay? This is a big, bold move. It's like they get this sudden desire to just do it, and they do it. Never-ending story. Now this, it happens to be reversed, so I am going to leave it reversed, but this is, I would say that it's pretty much the same thing. A lot of times when cards are in reverse, it's either an extreme meaning or it's the absence of. So I feel as though as for this, it's never, this is a never ending story. This is a story that hasn't ended. Okay, and perhaps it's time, and that's why the fool came up. Perhaps it's time to, you know, if you think what's it was three plus seven or seven plus three, it's a ten. Tens are completions. Okay, it's a completion of a chapter, a completion of a journey. Um, it's a completion of this story. Okay, it's time to start a new one and leave all the rest behind. So we're about to start our, a new story. Okay, or a new chapter. I guess those are it, huh? Five of Wands reversed and the Queen of Wands reversed. Now, somebody could be dealing with a third party. Because usually when the Queen of Wands comes up in a reading, it signifies that there's another woman. Okay, that means that there's another. Another, you get it? Another woman. Five of Wands reversed is competition. So, somebody could have... Or another man, even. Another person. Usually it's another woman, though. But it doesn't have to be. But anyway, uh, the Five of Wands is about co competition. Um, somebody is exhausted and fed up. There's been a battle. There has been some sort of fight with a person that is... Um, well, the Queen of Wands in reverse, this is somebody that is malicious. The Queen of Wands gets angry very easy. She's melodramatic. She can be very manipulating, controlling. She's a self-image problem. Self-righteous. Uh, this person is also very jealous. This per And there's been some sort of battle, some sort of competition. I feel like we do have a story that is coming to an end with an individual who is overly competitive. She is very forceful. She tries to force her will on others and she will lie to get her way. She'll do anything to get her way. She throws tantrums. She will ask, act in a hysterical manner. She th She's definitely entitled. She thinks that she can get what she wants with her looks. Okay, she uses her looks as a way to, as a weapon. Okay, um, and she thinks that her looks are going to get her the win. Okay, so that's what she thinks. Um, but there's this fight, this battle is coming to an end, okay, because the Five of Wands in reverse, I think there's been an extreme fight or an extremely 
competitive, uh, well, it's a battle of some sort that this fight for something. She's been competing for somebody's attention and she's been doing it in a nasty manner or she's been trying to win because in many, or in one deck especially, uh, there's, uh, this is the tug of war, you know, this tug of war is, it, this competition is coming to an end. Okay, it is. And this person has been competing. She's been competing for some for something. Okay. And she's been doing it in a malicious manner. Okay. The Queen of Wands in reverse is malicious and she lies and she's deceitful. Okay. She is. She's revengeful. Okay. She's she's very manipulative. And she can and she's unhealthy. Okay. Eight of Wands jealous. We have a we have a feminine here that has jealousy issues. And it feels like she's getting blocked or she's been blocking something or she's getting blocked or or she's she could be even being found guilty of something with this eight of wands reversed. This is this is guilty, this is blocked, this is jealousy, so she could be she's being found guilty of something. This is coming to a complete stop. Her actions, it's, whatever she's been doing, is coming to a complete stop. Very much, uh, there's a lot of fire energy here. It's all fire so far. It's like her fire is being stomped out. Okay, she, her, her, and, and I think that she's going to have a really hard time with this because she likes to be the center of tension. And if you think about fire, whenever you see a fire, if you think about the bonfire, everybody looks at the fire. When you see a fire, you're going down the road. What do you see? What do you do? You look at the fire. When you see a fire truck, you look at the fire truck. When you see fire, you look at fire. It's like this person isn't going to be happy when they are no longer the center of attention. Okay, this person likes to be the center of attention. They like to be in control. They like to have that power. I feel like we have somebody here that is losing their control. They're losing their power over a situation that they have been competing for. They've been trying to win. Two of Wands. Definitely we're dealing with a fire sign here. Uh, there's no doubt about it. So it's an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It's like... Uh, there's been a, there's been fear of change. There's been a delay. There's been a lot of back and forth. Um, there's there's been like it's like there's been a change brewing, right? But there's been a delay. There's been a delay. There's, there's, somebody has been unable to make a choice. A choice between two. A choice between paths. Somebody has been stuck. It's like they've been needing to make a choice, but they've been unable to make a choice. And I feel like whoever has been unable to make a choice or a decision is coming to some sort of conclusion now. It's like they've received some sort of information that is going to allow them to make a decision. It's going to help them to choose. And it does have something to do with this other woman or this, this malicious individual who lies and will do anything to get her way. Um, this never-ending story is coming to an end. Um, we The Fool... Which is interesting. That is starting from scratch. Starting over. New beginning here. Leaving everything behind. And it's funny. Isn't that what I saw at the beginning? Was the fool the, the big happy face? That's what I saw. This is an exciting opportunity for freedom. So I think that we have somebody here that is being broken free from a situation where they were manipulated. They were being controlled. They were being forced to do something. Because this is somebody who is very forceful. This is this is freedom. Freedom from, from being forced. Freedom from being controlled. Freedom from being... Uh, well, this is blocked. Controlled. From being controlled. That's what this is. Somebody is dealing with... Definitely, I think we have Aries and Leo pretty prominent here. Um, somebody may be going their own way and taking just their dog. It's like it's just you and the dog now. This is a, this is a very this is very free. It's just it's just it's just me and the dog. So somebody may be going their own way with taking just their dog. Um, this is definitely an exciting opportunity. This is leaving it all behind. It's like you have nothing left but the fucking dog. Excuse my language. I'm sorry. I don't know why that came out like that. Um, I guess the Aquarius is all about rebellion. And it's definitely showing out in me. 
Anyhow, um, we have a new beginning here that is coming. This is a starting fresh, taking a risk. We have somebody here that is, uh, this is a spur of the moment decision that is being made. That it's time to break free from a situation and leave it all behind. Wow, a lot of wands. And I've used this deck, I've had this deck for a long time. I just don't use it much, but it's definitely been shuffled. This reading, I, I mean, I've used it enough. There's no reason why all these wands are coming out, put it that way. The only reason these wands are coming out is because it's all about uh, movement. It's all about change. It's all about um, change. Okay. Um, taking action. Get prepared. Get prepared for an arrival or a departure because it's one or the other is going to happen. All right. Um, it's going to happen suddenly. There's going to be a sudden change. There's going to be a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. All of a sudden, somebody is going to a new destination. It's out of your control. You cannot control it. A decision is being made. This competition, this fight is over. Um, we're done battling. We're done watching you all battle. This is like from higher above. We're done. This is coming to a complete halt. It's time to break free from the, this, this whole situation. Uh, there's been enough bloodshed. It's over. So get prepared to leave or get prepared for an arrival or whichever one it is for you. I think that somebody has been, uh, very indecisive in regards to a third party situation as to who to choose, but the choice is being made now. Um, there's, there's, there's going to be an impulsive decision that is made and there is definitely going to be movement. Um, The High Priestess reversed. There's been some secrets. There's somebody who's been hiding the truth. Somebody may have definitely been involved with another woman. Okay. if there, uh, Another woman. I definitely see another woman that is very seductive here. Um, I see somebody has been hiding the facts. They've been hiding the truth. You could be dealing with the initials J and B or B and J. J and B or B and J in either um, sequence. Um, and I don't usually say that, but they just stood out really, really prominent to me. I do feel as though, um, you may, ha you may have been wondering if your intuition was correct and your intuition is absolutely correct. Um, don't doubt yourself for a minute. I think we have somebody that hasn't been listening to their intuition and I think that they, they, they know that whoever they've been dealing with has been engaging in risky behavior with another person and that is the truth. I do feel like that is the truth. I feel like there is uh, the third party could show up, could show up, they could arrive, they could arrive because they're upset, they didn't get their way, they didn't get chosen. You know, and they're upset because they didn't get chosen for whatever reason they show up at the homestead and cause an uproar could cause a fight it could really cause a fight between people if there is a third party there could definitely be a reveal um, because somebody doesn't get chosen their feelings get hurt and they didn't get communication you know they weren't they got blocked or something and they get pissed off and they retaliate because the queen of wands in reverse retaliates so there could be some retaliation that is coming up for um, not getting the attention. Okay, the Eight of Wands reversed. Somebody didn't get the attention that they were seeking and they flip out. Okay, so just keep that in mind. Um, this is for Monday the 20th. Princess of Pentacles. So this is the page if this is a dead end. Somebody hasn't been lacking with integrity. There's lack of commitment here. Somebody made a foolish mistake. Definitely this is foolish and this is foolish. Somebody has acted foolishly and got themselves involved in a third party situation with somebody. And that somebody that doesn't get chosen is going to speak up. And that is what I see. So be prepared for that. If you are not prepared, you best be getting prepared. This person may have kept quiet for a while, but when she doesn't get chosen, she cannot help herself. Think about fire. What happens? It explodes. Okay? It, it does. Remember, we explained fire a minute. You put a little bit of gas on that fire, and what happens? 
So anyhow, uh, be prepared. I think there there could be definitely somebody that uh, speaks their mind because they didn't get chosen, and um, they they may they you know they they're looking for they were they were hoping for something st- solid. They were thinking that they were going to get something solid, but that wasn't ever the case. Um, but they were naive. They were definitely definitely naive. So we have somebody here that acted in a naive way. And I think this person was naive because they thought that their looks could could uh, take care of the whole situation. But looks aren't everything and they aren't going to be in this next era. So just keep that in mind. Anyhow, um, somebody has been keeping a secret, but the secret is about to come out. We also have somebody here that is choosing to be single, okay, with these two cards. We have somebody here that is choosing to to stop communicating. They start choosing to stop giving any energy at all to anybody. It's like, you know what, I just want to be single. I want to do my own thing. I'm going to start my new life by myself. Somebody could be planning to travel. They could be planning to move. Somebody may be tra- planning to move a, a pretty good distance. You know, they may be saying, you know what, this is a dead end. This is a dead end town. This is a dead end city. There's no nothing for me here. It's time for me to go someplace else and try my, you know, put my feet someplace on different ground or whatever. Move. I do feel movement here. I feel like we have somebody that um, is feeling quite stagnant where they're at in life. And the best thing to do is just leave it all behind and go. So that is another message for somebody. It's like this is I'm I'm ready. I'm ready to go and this person just gets on board the next ship, gets on, on board the next plane or packs up their car and leaves. Okay? This is a sudden decision to leave, okay? Just to, to leave it all behind. So I do feel like that is coming up. Um and this is stopping communication, and this one is too. So I think there could be communication that comes to a complete halt for somebody. It's like, I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to. I don't ever even want to see you again. That kind of energy. There's, there's uh, no contact. Okay, no contact. There could be somebody that puts up, you know, this no contact, whatever that means to you. It's like, no, no more contact at all. Um, Somebody definitely hasn't been acting with integrity. They have been uh, involving another person, and the the truth is going to come out. Um, there's been a delay, though. There's been a delay in the truth coming out. There's been a delay in in choosing whether I should, whether or they should do this or not. You know, whether they should come forward or not. So this person has been in a state of thought, thinking about whether they should. Uh, express themselves I do feel like a sp- expression is definitely coming um, because this person sees it as a loss they do feel it as a big loss to them so I do feel like their overly competitive nature is going to get the best of them I do I really really do um, the, the ace of wands reversed on the bottom that's something going south really really fast something going downhill didn't grow um Something didn't grow, you know, it didn't materialize like it was supposed to. And because it didn't re- materialize, you know, that hurts. It hurts. So I think that we have somebody here that is going to lash out because they weren't chosen. And it's going to, you know, it could cause a huge uproar within the whole dynamics. And both, many people, everybody leaves. It's just a big, I mean, it's just this is this is going to cause freedom per- perhaps in every direction okay it, this is freedom so we have blockages here it's like the block it's like somebody has been unable to break free from or their own limitations. Do you know what I'm trying to say? They've been blocking their own success. They've been blocking their own happiness. And if and if and if you were happy, you wouldn't be in a third party situation or your partner wouldn't be in a third situation third party situation if you were happy. 
if it was stable, if it was solid, if it was secure, if it was meant to be long term, there wouldn't be no third party situations. And that's when you really got to think about it and check yourself and be like, you know, what am I worth? Who am I? Is this what I am? Is this what I'm worth? So I think that's what this is about. It's like we get somebody who comes to realization that, you know, I wasn't chosen. They get pissed and they're like, they go to reveal that to the other person, you know, so they know who they're dealing with. And, you know, that's what I feel like this is. I think there's going to be a huge uproar. So I don't need the tower card to see it. I say, I say get prepared. Get prepared for an arrival and then a departure. <laughs> so yeah I mean that's what I see I see I see starting over from scratch and leaving everything behind it's like I just want to go someplace else at this point and start my life someplace else where nobody knows me and I can just begin again so I do see traveling I do see moving I see uh, no contact I see uh Truth coming out, a secret being revealed. Uh, this fight is about to end. This competition is about to end. This has been a, there's probably could be a fight. There could be a battle that is upcoming because the one that didn't get chosen uh, flips out and uh, causes this, this decision to be made. And I think that nobody gets chosen, honestly. I think that, you know, in the end, nobody gets chosen, and this is all about freedom. And I think everybody is freed from this unhealthy situation. That's what I got. Good luck.